here we have is the response for Harry Styles when he tweet when he took this on Instagram and bring back manly man was trending because of that he quote tweeted on Instagram bring back manly man which I'll show you a screenshot of it He posted a picture of himself with a another dress that he's wearing while eating a banana, which captioned "Bring back manly men." And this was her first response when people tried to tell me I don't have influence, and then Harry Styles dedicates an entire post to my tweet. I inspire global conversation. Bring back manly hashtag bring back manly man shots fired. And then she <clears throat> continues responding to to Harry Styles' post saying hashtag BBMM, which stands for what I just read already, and she posted that with a picture of Harry Styles. Who's wearing this? And then people owned camera Candace Owens, like this person whose name is Friend Jill. Basora, who tweeted, she sounds like a fan. Unfortunately, her hateful comments are inspiring violence against gender non-conforming people, and it is atrocious. This isn't something to be proud of, real Candace O. It isn't a discussion when people's safety and lives are put at risk. Then she replied back, the left is trying to claim the expression of bring back many men is an act of violence. You need your head checked, buddy. No, he's not really saying that at all. He's saying that your hateful comments are an act of violence, Candace Owens. Oh. And here's a new tweet that she just tweeted right now. Women who objectify themselves by starting their legs for the world are lauded as courageous. Men in ball gowns and little girls clothing are honored as icons. Hollywood is no longer about diversity. It's about perversity. I speak for the people who do not worship perversity. A deliberate desire to behave in an unreasonable or an unacceptable way. Contrariness. There's this poor tweet that she made. There is no society that can survive without strong men. The East knows this. In the West, the steady manifestation of our men at the same time that Marxism is being taught to our children is not a coincidence. It is an outright attack. Bring back manly men. And then she desperately de defended herself two days later, since, uh, saying, since I'm trending, i like to clarify what I meant when I said, quote, unquote, bring back manly men. I meant bring back manly men. Turns like toxic masculinity were created by toxic females. We women don't do big feminism. Sorry, I'm not sorry. Which is just a, a bullshit outtake of what she's trying to what she's trying to like defend herself with.
I mean, many men can wear dresses just as much as a woman can wear a suit like you can. So, and you continue to tweet this out. PSA, mining pictures on the internet of men in dresses is not going to suddenly make me attracted to men in dresses. I'm impervious to woke cultures showing me that the examples of something won't make it any less stupid. And then she brings up the hashtag again by not getting the point. Men are manly enough to wear anything they want. And the fact that she has like missed the point a man who is man enough to do anything, including wearing a woman's dress. This is one of Candace Owens' worst arguments of all time. In the 2020 of history, she goes she goes after people when she knows that she's wrong. I mean, Elijah would put this perfectly. I think you missed the definition of what a man is. Masculinity alone does not make a man. Then she yelled in the tweet, Don't tempt me, Frodo. Sorry, one of my favorite movies. Couldn't miss the opportunity. I'm only human. And so is Harry Styles. And yet he couldn't accept the fact that he's man enough to wear a dress. And then she replied with a tweet under Donald Trump Jr. who says, you're never going to convince me that this isn't peak masculinity. And that is only photo. And that is likely a painting. Or most likely Photoshop. And then she replied, us gender normative bigots don't just don't get it. Of course you don't get it. Because you are not within the times. I mean seriously. You continuously make the worst takes of all. Even this guy called you out. Then she replied, the men who wear dresses have been flooding my Instagram videos proving that man's desire to wear limbs garments is not indicative of mental instability. Their, inst their feedback is more stunning, brave, and important than I could have ever imagined. The next phase of masculinity. The fact that Candace Owens has likely the absurd audacity to keep on saying that men are not manly enough to wear are not supposed to be manly enough to wear dresses, you know. Her own point is pointless when she's the one who's wearing a man's suit for a reason, then you ought to be the one with the problem. I mean, people have disagreed with you, like lots of them. I mean, can't you accept the fact that 
that people are just here to do whatever they want to do, can't you just accept the fact that Harry Styles can do whatever he wants to do? Like, come on. If you were really a nice person, Candace Owens, it's time for you to, like, stop being a misogynist. Okay? It's time for you to stop being a misogynist. And plus, once more, Harry Styles is a man who is man enough to wear anything he wants. And there's nothing you can do about that. Your opinion, your opinion about it after you've been, you've been seeing a trend which says, bring back Melly Man. Definitely means that you shouldn't even be talking bullshit in the first place when you are not manly enough to wear a man's suit. I mean, this is obviously why Candace Owens has to reply to this. And you know what? Here's a quote I'll read from Harry Styles. To not wear something because it's females is closing. You, sh- you shut out a whole world of great clothes. And that is a fact. If you don't wear anything just because for women, if you don't wear anything just because it's men, it's it's males. This males is closing. You have to shout out a whole world of great clothes. And that's what Kenneth Owens is trying to do with her own opinion. She's shutting this out because even though she at the time wore a man's suit, is shutting out a whole world of great clothes that she could wear. I mean, who's to say the last time Kenneth Owens did not wear a man's suit wasn't a whole world of great clothes. Now, and particularly, I am most likely proud of Harry Styles and for what he wears. And I have no issue with that. Kenneth Owens needs to grow the fuck up and start acting a little bit more mature on it. Of her age.